Yes. Thoroughly enjoyable play. And I must say, I enjoyed the match until the end. McEnroe goes off to shake, not to shake last grass hand. And if I was last grass, I wouldn't be too disappointed about that. The worst things have happened. When he grows up, he could be a decent fellow, John McEnroe. But I'm afraid he's left a sour taste in my mouth. He really is an extraordinary specimen. I won't carry on. I think you've got uh, the gist of what I feel. But no matter, McEnroe is through 7-5. But there's not much joy in his victory or in watching it. The Basel exhibition was brought to you by Rico. Catch up with the latest news and the story of qualifying for Sunday's Portuguese Grand Prix after the break here on Eurosport. Oh. <laughs> well, is uh, giving McEnroe the option to serve again, which McEnroe took and uh, takes him... It's a 40 30. Yeah. So it's from one extreme to the other. Sportsman like behavior from Jimmy Connors to the extreme. Calling the let and giving uh, McEnroe another service. But the psychological battle continues from John McEnroe. The question calls, the body language. Time he takes between services. McEnroe of old. It's a very wayward shot from John McEnroe. Lofting the ball on the half volley. And the attempt at the drop shot. Lacking the pace needed. 40 love Connors. Three games all, first set. Connors with his first double fault. Delightful tennis. These two have had some battles over the years. The crowd here remember the best of them. And uh, they're being treated to a vintage display. McEnroe at full stretch, reaching that on the forehand. 40-30.
Oh, and a clumsy mistake really from John McEnroe on that occasion. Drawing Jimmy Connors into the net. But uh, his drop shot again for the second time in that game was short. Connors leads four games to three. First set. We'll take a break now. Welcome back. New balls for John McEnroe to serve at Jimmy Connors. He trails 3-4. First set. And again, the mistakes are coming very much from John McEnroe, whether it's a lack of concentration or just a lack of match practice. But errors that in his heyday would uh, seldom occur are coming thick and fast. Tightest of angles. McEnroe left standing and staring. Connors reached this on the backhand. Top spin. McEnroe watched it land in. Action play that time from John McEnroe. His volley was short this time. Connors could have gone either way with that one. McEnroe guessed right. 15.30. Oh! Second double fault for John McEnroe. Gives two break points to Jimmy Connors. Again, he takes plenty of time between services. He seriously thought that that uh, service was in. I think that was more of a frustrated look. Oh, and he'll be frustrated again by that uh, blistering return from J.S. Connors. Service played right to Connors' forehand. He just stabbed at it but picked his spot. McEnroe unable to reach, lunging to his left. Connors moves to a 5-3 advantage opening set and serving now for the first set. No mistake with the overhead. Connors way short on the lob. hit from McEnroe on that occasion, 15 all.
And again, the defensive play from both competitors from the back of the court has uh, left something be, to be desired. McEnroe's uh, taking the opportunity to rest his legs. Stuff. Connors comes out of that one on top. And there's no doubting the entertainment value of this match. And as long as John McEnroe continues to mind his P's and Q's, then uh, this will be the perfect finale to what has been an enthralling tournament. Jimmy Connors, 43 years of age now, the winner of 109 singles titles in his career, has two set points. But needs only one. 6 3. The score in the open up in favour of Jimmy Connors. And uh, the truth be told, he has been all over John McEnroe. McEnroe must now compose himself and come back in the second. Welcome back to the Yakub Talat in Basel, where John McEnroe has lost the first set to Jimmy Connors. Six games to three. And there have been uh, moments of McEnroe of old, as yet nothing has developed into anything sinister like it did in yesterday's semi. McEnroe has uh, kept his tongue clean. Lovely start for Connors. Again, McEnroe backpedaling for the overhead. Unable to get enough power behind the smash and uh, pushed it into the net. Turn from Jimmy Connors had time. The second service from John McEnroe was played short. Sat up nicely for Connors. And he picked his spot perfectly just inside the tram line. Good start in the second for Connors. Love 30. Specimen. I won't carry on. I think you've got uh, the gist of what I feel. But no matter, McEnroe is through. Yes. Thoroughly enjoyable play. And I must say, I enjoyed the match until the end. McEnroe goes off to shape the 7 5. But there's not much joy in his victory or in watching it. Not to shake Last Graf's hand. And if I was Last Graf, I wouldn't be too disappointed about that. The worst things have happened. When he grows up, he could be a decent fellow, John McEnroe. But I'm afraid he's left a sour taste in my mouth. <laughs> 